smoke from a car bomb billowing in the sky above Kabul. The bombing happened at the height of rush hour, injuring and killing people on their way to work. The suicide blast occurred near Afghanistan's National Security Agency. I was working and then there was a big blast. There was dust everywhere. I couldn't see what was happening. Later, I saw there was a lot of damage. Security forces immediately surrounded the area. The Taliban claim responsibility for the suicide attack, the first major bombing in Kabul since they announced the start of their spring offensive last week. Annually, the Taliban steps up attacks in the spring. A reminder to the population, government and foreign powers of their still strong presence in the country. President Ashraf Ghani condemned the attack in the, quote, strongest possible terms. He has struggled to consolidate his power after a contested 2014 election and the resurgence of the Taliban. U.S. Secretary of State John Kerry made a surprise visit to the capital last week to lend support to Ghani's unity government and to call for the Taliban to restart peace talks.